Good afternoon, everybody. So I'm just getting ready for the day before I go run a couple of last minute Dapper Day errands. Eve is getting into the desk. A um, few last minute Dapper Day errands. And then <clears throat> I'm gonna pick up Peter from work. And then we're gonna go straight to Hollywood Studios tonight for Fantasmic Fridays. That's the plan for tonight, but I kind of wanted to clue you in on some of the plain crazy stuff that I'm working on now to prepare for when we're gone for Thanksgiving. This little girl is investigating. She likes to sit under the desk, but recently she's been getting into those cords. It was fine when she was just relaxing, but we'll have to see how it goes. Also, her little ear tufts are not there anymore. I don't know, well this one's kind of there. But if you ever notice, she has those like little white pieces of fur. And now they're not there. I don't know what happened. Every monthly pack has a mystery button, so I've put all of these little question mark stickers on those. That's what they come in. Every um, subscription also comes with a handwritten note. These are for just normal subscribers. This is the stack of people who don't usually um, get packs, so they're a little bit more personalized because it's their first order or whatnot. Um, these are the stickers for this month. I, I didn't really show them much. I should really get back into the swing of having the sticker design up when the rest of the artwork is revealed. So those are all set. So now I am going to get the address labels all in order. We are having the buttons and the backers, the paper backers that we like hook them onto, um, sent to my mom's as well as the envelopes just so it doesn't take too much um, room up in our luggage. So we're just going to bring like the supplies that goes with it and hopefully everything will be laid out and set. So then Tuesday when they go out, or no, Wednesdays when they go out, um, Tuesday we'll be able to get everything up and then bring them to the post office in Chicago on Wednesday. Um, so it might be late night Tuesday, but we just, it's the best way to get it out. We can't possibly pack them all in the luggage. So now I'm just being proactive and getting everything organized. So we're ready. Did you guys know that this song is from Meet Me in St. Louis? It's not really a Christmas movie. It kind of covers all the holidays, but kind of just gives you that Christmas feeling. So I always watch it at this time of year. Look at me, I feel like I'm in like winter. I'm wearing jeans. I'm wearing jeans, shoes. I hate shoes, but I'm wearing them because we had errands to run, so we came here straight from work, and then had to go send some packages, do a bunch of other boring stuff, and now we're here for Fantastic Friday, which we haven't done in what, like? Two, three weeks? Three weeks, and we passed up the, the fuel rod. Fuel rod's over here. You're good to go. Maybe we can share that. How much percent do you have? 15. Oh, maybe you need that whole thing. <laughs> okay, I'm starting to sweat. No. A little bit. It's so magical here. Single rider, rock and roller coaster is our first attraction. Yes. So we've realized something over the past, what, like two weeks? We haven't been doing a lot of rides because there's so many, like, things to see and to attractions to go look at and events to, to attend that we haven't really gone on any rides in a long time. So we have two hours before Fantasmic, so we're going to try to go on some rides. We don't know what happened, but we waited single line, single rider line for like 30 minutes and we, we, get, we get to go together. There's nobody in the other line. I don't know what happens, but something happens. It's called magic here. Magic! We're gonna push our luck and see after the wildest ride in the rock and roll world if oh. we can go on. Never mind. Because it's 60 minutes. Do you hear the little boy? So we push our luck. We're not going on. We're not going on rock or tower tear. But that just means it's time to get our holiday drink and to get our holiday on. With all this wondrousness, all the snow. That dog is amazing. That dog just ate a little puppuccino. 
What are your thoughts on puppuccinos? We should bring Eve home one. Or can we go through a drive through Starbucks? Do all Starbucks do puppuccinos? What is a puppuccino? I don't know. Well, that dog loved it. Still licking his chops. Licking her chops. So cute. Ba -ba -ba. Look at all the beautiful decorations. Is this Sarah's favorite song? Because it comes from the richest man in town. Sarah's favorite movie, and arguably one of the best scenes in all of cinematic history. Can't even think about it for too long. Can you show how ridiculous we are with all of our beverages? We just got a venti water and a holiday drink. And yes, I got a frappuccino because I'm a little warm in my jeans and my shoes. My toes are hot. You guys, I got a mocha hot chocolate. Yeah, I don't think Sarah realized. Wrong sequence, it felt so. <laughs> I don't think Sarah ever realized that like you can pretty much ask the Starbucks people to do or make like whatever. Just stick to the books, kind of gal. Yeah. Look how cool these lights look coming up from the side of the Chinese theater. I always want to call it call this Car Carthay Circle, and I just got myself sung tongue tied, <laughs> so tongue tied. See? Oh yeah. Oh, it smells vacationy. Fifteen minute. Um, wait for Toy Story Mini because I still can't speak English. Looking good. I, you know what? I've never walked yeah, through this fun. this queue before. I, this is the first time I've ever walked through the standby queue. I've never seen this. I just got a screen before. I've never seen that Ferris wheel. So we basically have to go on this and then run to Fantasmic. Because it's like 7.40. And Fantasmic's at 8.30. Wish, wish us luck. Two to 196. Good job. I won every game until the last one. You did win. You won every game. I was busting vehicle. I was busting vehicle. Woo! You won every round except for the last. Good job, baby. I was hurt in that last one. I was feeling good. Yeah, you got to the 2000s pretty quick. Yeah. Good job. You ready for some Fantasmic? Yes. Look at this. There's so much going on right now. Woo! And we got Fantasmic over there calling our name. Look at this. We're over in the fast pass section. Never said it before. We're literally the farthest stage right we could sit. We're usually like right about there. But now we're all the way over here. We're gonna either we're gonna end the wave. Yeah.
We're showing you our Dapper Day stuff. Yes, so we're gonna get our, this vlog actually, we're gonna edit right now and get to bed because we have to be at Magic Kingdom Park open because it is Dapper Day and our first Dapper Day. So we're not gonna tell you who we are. We're a couple. We're a couple. We want you to guess and put it down in the comments down below because this will actually go live when we're walking into the park. So I think we're gonna our put- Our other thing is that our, the genre of clothing, like the time period, goes with the movie. Yes. And I got an orange feather over here, this cool hat. So I it's got, a Disney mount, so think of colors and think of placement. I've got these suspenders. Mm -hmm. I've got this bow tie. Sorry, I have to keep this high because Eve wants yes. it as a chew toy. This bow tie. I've got this pin. What else I got? I got this shirt that I'm gonna go iron in just a second. And this is like the wow piece right here, don't you think? <laughs> I got these pants. Yellow pants. These yellow dress pants. So, that's my outfit. More complicated than mine. So here's yes. my dress. I got more pieces in there. So I got this flapper girl dress. Mm-hmm. Bracelet. One set of earrings. Shiny, shiny. Another set of earrings. These earrings. Girl yes, that Sarah made part of. Does this look any familiar? So let us know down in the comments below. They guess who we are. We will probably say on our Instagram story tomorrow, early afternoon. Mm -hmm. But definitely subscribe to our channel so you can hear like the whole breakdown on tomorrow's video. Yes. And what's today's date? Like Friday's date. The 17th. So, I have one more special thing to show you before we do our sign-off. Okay, well, I have one special okay. thing in news. Okay. Splash Mountain is back up. Okay. That's great. We're going on it tomorrow. We should do that last just in case we get wrecked. We'll do that last. Um, I want to show you one thing that we got from an, an awesome gift from my coworker, and it actually is perfect because as you're watching this, it is Mickey Mouse's birthday. So, wish him happy birthday, and what we're going to show you is also to celebrate his birthday, but 20... Nine birthdays ago. Well, <laughs> look at this painting, this picture. This is a John Hench original piece of art signed by him in pencil on the bottom right. One of 4,200 limited release, and it's to celebrate Mickey's 60th birthday. And today, as well, tomorrow when you're watching this today, his 89th birthday. So it's super cool. You're looking good, Mouse. You can all boy. see all Mickey through the years and Minnie through the years. Some cool books. Uh, there's a Hi. globe here, which we haven't looked at, but we figure it's probably close to when Disneyland Paris was getting figured out. But there's a globe here with a, 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 a flag, flag. In, from France. So this is from my coworker, from work, whose dad worked for Walt Disney World for, she said, years. I don't know how he got a hold of it, but um, it was for his 60th birthday, like Mickey's 60th birthday. And a little breakdown about um, John Hench and a certificate of authenticity number 3373 of 40, the lot is 4200. And with that, I can't wait to get this right. <laughs> it's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.